Matty, two more years, congratulations. How does it feel to be here for the foreseeable future? Yeah, I'm delighted to be here um, for another two years, at the very least, hopefully. But um, yeah, it's a right, in the right, pushing the right direction for me personally. To be here at this club as well, obviously a club we know you've got so much history with on a personal level, it must mean that extra, extra bit more, I think. Yeah, definitely. When, like I've said before, when I've been sat in the stand watching as a kid, and then now playing in front of what 18,000, and majority is 15,000 every home game, and there's no better feeling than playing in front of that. What's the season been like for yourself? You obviously shared that left back berth really with Liam right now for a lot of the season. Scored a few goals and, and created a few assists as well. Has it been one of more productivity for you? Would you say? Yeah, I think it's been a successful season uh, personally for me. I, I think I've played over 20 games, which is what, I, what most I've got out of any season um, so far at this club. So it's only a step in the right direction for me. And on a personal level, I assume it's a bit of a feeling of unfinished business, and that contract represents, you know, something more that you want to achieve as part of this club as well. Having not finished, perhaps where we where we would have liked to. Have been. Yeah, obviously this year was probably under underachieved. I'd probably say we did, but I think next year with the plans we've got as a football club, I think we'll have a real good go next year. Just explain to us where we are at the minute and why we are here, because it's uh, it's not Valley Parade as you might be able to imagine. No, it's the um, a local park where I used to play football with my mates and. Used to call carnage in here, um, but no, I think it's brought me back to a little bit, few memories. Wearing a Bradford City shirt as well, presumably. Yeah, obviously. Yeah, um, running around, causing carnage as a kid was. It's called Victoria Park as well. There's something in that, given the fact that you were you scored there this season against Hartlepool United, and does that represent again a little bit more of what you've been trying to do this season on a personal note? Yeah, definitely. I've tried to chip in with a few goals and assists and. I think that's part of my game, what I want to bring more to the club. In terms of how proud it makes you to represent this club, you've spoken before about how many friends you've got, how many family members you've got who are all Bradford City supporters. You yourself playing in this park as a kid in a Bradford City shirt, running around and, and wishing that you were going to represent some of your heroes from that time, it must mean a lot to you. Yeah, definitely. I think it's it's quite... Um, it's can't really put into words how I feel. Like it's quite exciting for me to be playing um, for a Valley Parade thinking about when I was here as a kid and then going out and doing it. Mark Hughes, what's he been like with new gaffer who's obviously come in, you've featured quite a bit under him most recently and the final game of the season at the weekend, has it been a joy to work with him really? Yeah definitely, he's brought um, a new relief to the club I think, um, his different style of football, what we've used to what we've used to add, um, but I think everyone knows and hope they all know that we've got something special going at this football club now. On Saturday, just briefly, again, a great atmosphere and a great result, really, and finishing the season strongly with three back-to-back -back victories. Does that show you, really, the potential of the club in terms of you know the fans that we can get there and the atmosphere we can generate and what we can do on the field as well? Definitely. I think if we get the place going next year, um, I think there'll be 18,000 every home game. And I think Saturday proves that they will turn out for us. I guess it represents a little bit more for you as well, having been one of those supporters who was in the stands you know, back in the day and now playing out on the field at Valley Parade, I suppose it resonates with you a little bit more how, how good it can be when it's bouncing. Yeah, I've, I've been there when it's, it is bouncing at like Leeds, Arsenal, and then on Saturday it was bouncing again when I'm playing, which is quite, it's, it was brilliant for me to be a part of. Sorry, that was <laughs> not right there. <laughs> the sound got bright, right? Oh, it was. Yeah.